WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento for TFNN, checking in to see what the markets are doing. And, folks, we are rocking and rolling today. We had a beautiful three drive to a bottom pattern. I posted it here in the Dow Jones Industrial Average, exactly at the 78% level of the October 2nd low when we were making new lows in the NASDAQ and we were making new lows in the S&P 500. So it was a big divergence there. And as you can see, the leader of the pack so far has been the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Gold has come back. Uh, we'll call, talk about gold when we get back to the beginning of the show. But uh, we should mention that currencies have all turned uh, rally. We've had about a 150-point pip rally in the uh, British pound and uh, just about the same thing, about 100 pips in the euro. These are, these are uh, what we call dead cat bounces, folks. That's what we're looking at here in the currency. So that's really what we're looking at. Same thing in the Treasury bonds. I'll cover that during the regular show. We're having a nice two-point rally in Treasury bonds from a handle of 123 up to 125. What I can't understand is why on Bloomberg today, everybody is rejoicing and saying the bear market is over. The bear market is over. Yes, it, it could be. And also Santa Claus might come tomorrow. I don't know which one will be true. But this is, to me, looking at this, this is nothing more than a uh, bear market rally. We do have these reports coming out. And also, by the way, we have Rich Anderson as our guest here today. We're going to be talking about the grains and also about the bond market and some of the things that are going on in, uh, in the world of geopolitics and stuff. Not politics, but geopolitics. Big difference, of course. And then tomorrow, of course, we're going to have uh, Bill Meridian of Cycles Research is going to be my guest. So... I think we've got a really nice group this week, and uh, we've had lots of volatility. Uh, we had a new low in the S&P today, folks. We got down to uh, 36, excuse me, 35.80. The low, uh, previous low was 35.85. And those of you that like uh, A, B, C, D type patterns, you'll be able to see one when we uh, post this next chart because it just pops up just as clear as a bell. So hold on one second, and we will get this chart up. God willing, and she usually is. So let's see if we can get it up here. And we'll be right back, folks. 877-927-6648. 